How's it going, Greg? Just wandering around down there. If you remain in this zone, you will be <laughs>
But anywho, good pl ADS oh. placement there is gonna catch one of the nades. And now there's a deployable in bathroom that Goyo's gonna play. From Grixer and United are gonna be a little bit worse on the utility there. <laughs> yeah, so it's a lot of shield investment there from SSG and. All As he starts to apply pressure to Grixer. Gas canister going onto the stage. There's the second nade. And it's caught as well by the oh, wow. ADS. And no breaches on Yeti. This is huge. EU90 has no... They have no soft destruction. No breaches. They have no soft destruction. They have no soft destruction. This is an example of the castle barricades not necessarily helping a teammate play in a certain part of the map, but wasting utility to allow the enemy to use their gadgets and keep control over a site by using the shields. It's for this reason that some people are predicting a, quote, castle Goyo meta that's going to be very, very powerful in the years to come if we don't take away one of Goyo's shields. Castle's barricade here allows Canadian to play on the white stairs without getting pressured from a rappel from the window. So the castle barricade can be used both as a utility dump and also as a defensive measure to protect you. He's going to get shot in the back, but then cleaned up by Rampy, Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. E United used up so much of their utility trying to take piano that they couldn't get into the bomb site. As far as guns are concerned, the M10 and the UMP both stink. But one of them is more fun to use than the other one. There's two there. There's Buck Ashes and Red. Ashes Red. Ashes Red. Ashes Red. Nice. Wait, let me peel the UMP. Oh. Sometimes. I will now leave you some castle default strats to use either solo queuing or in your ranked stack. Timestamps are in the comments below. Villa. For Aviator Games, castle off the double door leading to statue and the door leading to trophy. As my buddy Alex puts it, you want to make the attackers work for that map control. Place the last one on study door or study balk. For trophy, place it on master bedroom door, astronomy window, and bathroom door. Coastline. On hookah, get the big window in billiards, castle off VIP, and castle off the hookah room window to keep people from repelling on it. For kitchen, get the kitchen window, the sunrise big door, and the blue bar door by the 90 cam. At Outback, big Australia. On office party, get the office window, the shark window, and of course, the bowl window. Give Fed Dostoevsky. On top floor, make sure to get piano windows as well as piano mini bar window facing west. Kitchen, castle of men, as well as both doorways to cut off small bakery. Chalet. This might seem funny, but just get the double doors and the trophy window when you're playing kitchen trophy. Put some goyos in there and uh, you got a real time waster on your hand. K anal. If you're defending first on this map, it's literally free low. You can cut off the entrance leading outside from King George or White Room, whatever you want to call it, as well as printer room window as well as green window or red window, depending on what you want to do. Or if you want to do runouts on white, you can just get both the green and red windows. Bank. On CEO office on the top floor, it's pretty much up to you. You can get the banana windows and any manner of windows and couches, but this will keep your flanks protected and allow you to peek the north windows a little bit. As a castle with impact grenades, you may be expected to impact trick the CEO walls through the little hole at the top. Alex explains to you here why you should reinforce them on the other side. Put it like this on this left side. A slider bug can come over here. They can open it up. And they put the thermite charge in here and it's it can't get uh, impact trick. Clubhouse. When defending cash, you can obviously help out your bandit tricker by getting the window behind him by the server stack, but you can also seal off construction as well as the blue stair entrance. Consulate. On the top floor where the console office is, Castle off the main entrance there, then impact a hole to the northeast, kind of like the right if you're facing towards small office from console office. Then castle off the top of spiral, and then for your last one, you can put it either on the top of yellow or connector window. For the basement, you can get the doorway near Harry Potter, as well as the big server double door, and then the yellow stairs door at the bottom. It's not every map, but I hope these get you on the right track and help you out a little bit. Castle barricades take 12 melee hits to take care of, or they can be blown up instantly with an ash charge, a Zofia impact, a sledgehammer, grenades, anything that can deal with soft breachy stuff. They're also fusible and leave a nice tiny little murder hole for fuse to peek you with, so watch out.
second floor. In conclusion, I would say that Castle's gadget is not necessarily difficult to use, but does require a little bit of research. What makes Castle more difficult to play is his UMP-45. It's time to kill with body shots isn't actually terrible, but it's the slow rate of fire that makes getting headshots with it much more difficult than Castle's peers who often have high rate of fire, low recoil guns. It also has a pretty small magazine size which isn't helping it much. Here I have it kitted out the way Fox A uses it. I don't know why he uses it this way, but he drops aces with it. So I'm not gonna take it away from him. This is how I use it, which isn't really saying much. But that skin do be looking kind of fresh though. Actually, he do be looking kind of fresh though. Castle is an operator who plays off of his teammates. Collaborating with the Mira is very useful because it can help her wash her flank. Collaborating with the Goyo makes your team a utility sink. You can help your bandit bandit trick. The list goes on and on. As long as you don't be a complete moron and trap your teammates in the objective, you're good. Castle's the guy you bring along with the big picture in mind. Play the meta game and you will do well. Maybe play a little bit of T-Hunt to get the UMP down because you will need some aim to get anything at all out of that gun. But if Fox A can drop an ace with it, anything is possible. The Invitational is coming up, so I highly encourage you to watch this year and see how the pros use him. He's not a bad operator by any stretch of the imagination. And that's all you really need to know about the castle that you can't hassle. Droning blue tarp. He's joining out the window, south window. Hallway. Joining in south window? There you go. Coming up next is Castle's white friend Pulse. I'm getting tracked by Jackal. I don't know where though. They've been all over the map. Deuces. Yeah.